Hello everyone, welcome to ISRO preparation strategy video that is your phase 2 and final phase for your ISRO exam. I hope your preparation is going well as per our phase 1 and lots of uh, extra days you have got. Okay, so in that I hope you covered a uh, few more subjects also by yourself. But now in this video, I will discuss that what other subject okay, you need to complete for to finish your ISRO preparation. Along with that, now I will not repeat other things which I have repeated al already told you in your phase 1. Okay. Quickly, we will finish this video and so from uh, from this video, you will get idea that how much syllabus you have to complete for ISRO exam and branch wise, I will give you the guidelines that you have to follow. Okay. So now the phase two, obviously there is no period in that because today uh, you know that is the 9th of July. Okay. So just you can consider 30 to 45 days maximum now from today. Okay. 35, 30 to 45 days maximum for electrical. Definitely it will be less. Okay. Around uh, you can say 20, 30 days you have. Okay, as per uh, exam date, what I told you in phase one. As per that only, you need to prepare and you need to complete the syllabus. And then the further things I will definitely when, uh, make one separate video. Okay, for you guys. So this is the period for your phase two. Okay, and now branch wise we will start discussion. But before that, non-technical part which is common for all the branches. What are the things you need to cover there? So next is profit on loss. Okay, then simple interest compound interest is there. And that's it for aptitude. No need to do lots of things in aptitude. This much part is enough for your apti part. Okay. Then in reasoning, other things already we covered. Then along with that, non-verbal reasoning. Every topic related to non-verbal. Okay, you need to do like embedded figure, then figure counting. Okay, then uh, paper cutting, paper folding, water image. Every non-verbal reasoning topic you need to do for your ISRO exam. Okay, then analogy classification. These two also important. Okay, special reasoning. So this special reasoning part, uh, the is in recent gate previous year paper you will get the questions okay so i will recommend you that aptitude of gate pyq at least start from 2018 gate pyq to 2023 okay so this part you can solve for to preparation for special reasoning and other things okay yeah here i guess in uh, this six years everything is covered right for your practice then number series wrong number series or missing number series confirm they will ask you and the most important that is your data interpretation so now I hope that in phase one, I told you to complete few things. Okay. Few chapters. Now I hope you got the reason that what is the reason was that this is the reason that DI. Okay. So now whatever you learn so far that you will implement in DI. Okay. For non-technical again, your cue box is there for master SFX student. So you can use that. Okay. For other student, you can use telegram PDF, daily telegram PDF you are getting. So just use, make user proper that. Okay. So for aptitude. You will refer our two PDF that is first is aptitude questions 10 questions I guess you are getting daily and second PDF is DI okay and for reasoning only one PDF you will refer that reasoning question no need to solve puzzle okay because puzzle is not for ISRO basically only 10 question daily question you are getting for reasoning that you need to practice okay so this is of all your non-technical part which is most important because remember that non-technical part don't have negative marking so this is very important and first time they are introducing this part in their paper. Okay. Now first branch that is electronics and communication. Okay. Now first important thing that for MSP student, I hope our block wise strategy you are following rigorously. Currently block three is going on, right? We will soon enter in one to two days into the block four. So just make proper use of your block wise strategy, which is most powerful. Okay. Whatever things are given there, just follow that completely. And those who didn't join master success pack for electronics in the comment section, you will get the link. If you are seriously preparing for ISRO exam, because all the things I will cover here, whether you are CBT and interview, okay, both the things we will cover. So you can join that. If you miss that, then in the comment section, you will get all the links. Okay. Quickly join and start your block wise strategy. When you will join, okay, then you will start with block wise strategy. Okay. Now other subject that you need to cover more, more, one more important thing that now, okay, the list I have given here. As per this sequence only, try to complete the things, okay, for all the students. So, first signal system you will complete, okay. Second, you can see here analog communication I have written. Then random variable and process you have to complete. Then digital communication, then control, electronic devices, analog electronics, setcom, microwave, measurement and engineering mathematics, okay. So, along with the previous subject, just add this much subject and this is the whole syllabus of ISRO. That's enough. Some definitely miscellaneous questions will be there but no need to do that okay because see our target is selection and uh, you know our golden rule don't forget it right so now very important thing okay those who are new student 
definitely phase one all com all subject i want from you guys okay specifically a guidelines for new student not for repeater because repeater i am expecting that all the things you will cover maximum things you need to cover obviously your repeater right you are not studying for first time ha huh. now for new student basically do signal and system on priority okay then hold your communication analog plus digital you will do on priority okay listen carefully then control system okay then you can go for satcom if you have your engineering books b btech books satcom you can use or otherwise one shortcut i will give you that whatever questions i will add in your block plus mock okay again i will repeat whatever questions i will add in your block plus mock only do that thing only those concept you can do okay and plus you will add here apna quick revision ebook whatever concept uh, basic basic concept are there in your quick revision ebook about satcom that three things you will combine that's it okay no need to refer any full notes and full subject because obviously time is less right next thing same for microwave same for microwave engineering okay measurement don't do skip it completely skip it fine right then go for engineering mathematics now he engineering mathematics if you study if you are comfortable in vbtech by studying your uh, matrices then calculus then you can do uh, now suppose if you don't have uh, hands on down the those topic you don't forget up everything about linear algebra and everything you can still skip engineering mathematics okay one more shortcut i will give that what your questions of engineering mathematics i will add in your block mock and ebook that you can do optional okay so i hope you understand that your phase 1 subject are super crucial for you guys okay and for phase 2 already i have given the guidelines okay two subject you can skip here and say for satcom micro that is extra subject no we are not putting any extra effort whatever i will give you just go with that definitely that will help you in exam no need to worry for that okay that responsibility is obviously mine right and for repeater same thing okay same thing you can use or obviously you can do all the things it's up to you what you see basically individually each or uh, each one of you have different uh, preparation levels okay but here i am considering only general because in your msp we take one to one call and based on your condition your preparation level okay i guide you guys but now here obviously it is general because i am pr presenting this on youtube so not possible to give you personal guidelines because each and one of you are unique right you have unique job someone is someone is doing working someone is preparing full time so not possible that's why i will recommend that if you are not joined msp yet join master sepac asap so that you will prepare is for isro fully okay it is not like something is miss you feel like that because this is the golden opportunity with such number of vacancy you are getting for this year okay okay now the next thing that about mock test schedule and everything definitely i will disclose that soon just stick to our block wise strategy plus revise 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 and do the study correct so this is all about this and definitely uh, if you have any query you have definitely you can ask me no problem with that right all the best for your preparation okay i will meet you in the next video soon okay next branch is computer science so i hope your preparation is going well for isro exam right now the important thing that uh those who are new students specifically okay first i will target you guys so see whatever subject i told in phase 1 i hope you do that properly right for msp student basically our block wise strategy is going on so i hope you are giving your block seriously and rigorously because this is most important okay whatever i am giving you in block wise so just follow that rigorously those who didn't know about block wise strategy those who didn't about know about master success pack in the comment section you will get the link okay if you are seriously preparing for isro then join master success pack as soon as possible so that you will be on track okay with your preparation that is important so see along with now phase 1 subject okay phase 2 subject also you have to do but here what you can do i will give you something because obviously you are new student you are preparing for first time so not possible to complete whole syllabus and not required also let me tell you right so now few guidelines i will give you just pay your full attention here and listen carefully and then i will come to repeater okay for repeater there is no nothing because obviously you are repeater you have already studied this subject so i am expecting that lots of things you can do but still if you are not feeling uh, well in some subject then let's see whether you can skip it or not okay so see after your phase 1 now the next subject i want you to take your digital electronics okay the sequence is important focus on sequence digital logic right then coa and operating system then go to dbms then you can go for software engineering okay then you can go for discrete mathematics and now here two things are important okay you can skip compiler if you want 
if you are not comfortable if uh, if you think okay it will too much for me in this short period of time skip it no problem right second c++ and java this also you can skip no problem in that because only one to two questions are expected okay that is also means not confirmed so that's why you can also skip this part no problem okay toc also you can skip again there is no problem with uh, means you can skip that completely okay in engineering mathematics linear algebra uh, differential equation and your uh, calculus part now and numerical method so see if you studied this in your bb tech or if you know this thing if you prepare for gate and everything okay and if you think okay i can do this i know the basics i know the theory okay i know the concept i can do go for it otherwise if it is too much for you okay because see this sequence is most important first priority is to complete this third thing in this sequence only and then last you will come to engineering mathematics if time is there then you can go for that otherwise you can skip this also okay there is no problem that you can skip this also correct now one shortcut i will give you what you can do see basically what you can do here that compiler okay and c++ java i guess a very little uh, weightage but still okay and engineering mathematics so now whatever question i will add in your block plus your mock test that you can do okay that you can do so that it is not like you are completely skipping the subject okay when you can do this when you are you completed all the things which i mentioned earlier okay otherwise don't touch it because if you want to study more and more if you want to complete more and more in this less time it is not possible okay it is not possible just accept it and why whatever guidelines i am giving you just work as per that only okay okay and for repeaters the same sequence you can follow for phase 2 and if you are comfortable in all this then you can do everything okay because you already know and the uh, main thing is there that you have a block wise strategy and mock test which we will start soon and block wise is currently going on which will help you to prepare individual subject and you will get confidence in individual subject okay so okay so i hope uh, you know now that what are the phase 2 subject how to do preparation any query any doubt you have you can contact me name okay there is no problem and those who didn't join master success pack yet you can join master success pack all the links you will get in the comment section right i will meet you in the next video about our schedule and mock test everything okay till then prepare seriously because this is the golden opportunity and now we are in july month second week don't forget this okay so make proper utilization of your time that is most important all the best okay next is for electrical so for electrical guys you got almost got two and half month right for preparation and your ex exam is expected in this month only let's see what happens but the main thing is that in the upcoming or uh, i guess at uh, 15 to 16 days we need to complete the things right now other subject measurement and instrumentation control power system electromagnetic field signal microprocessor basics of electronics and material science and engineering mathematics okay if this subject is new for you specifically for new student i am giving you a guideline then you can skip this part and engineering mathematics also you can skip no problem in that okay but this subject whatever you do all are important and you do do that compulsory there is no option here okay you have next thing for repeaters obviously i hope that uh, every subject you covered but still uh, if you have time then you can go for material science okay and basics of electronics pn junction etc that you can do correct okay so this is all for your electrical branch now those important thing those who didn't join master success pack yet and preparing for isro join master success pack because we are in currently block 3 okay current soon we will go to block 4 in one to two days so that you will get good grip on each and every subject also you will have timeline and dedicated path to prepare for isro exam so in the comment section you will get master success pack link just join that and every guideline definitely one to one i will talk with you okay no need to problem in that so main thing is that if you are serious then join as soon as possible because already we have less time only one month we have for your exam correct and other than this i hope everything is clear now okay just start your preparation seriously because this is the golden opportunity of 2023 all the best okay next branch is mechanical now the other things like references and everything that will remain same as i told you in the phase 1 okay in phase 2 i will told, tell you that what other subject you need to complete so that you will get idea about your isro syllabus complete correct so see the next subject you will start is strength of material okay then you can move for theory of machines then machine designing okay sequence is important again next subject is storm okay then tom you can do then go for thermodynamics and application then you can go for material science right and then after completion this you can go for machine design correct then mechanical vibration and uh, production industrial engineering and engineering mathematics now basically see 
here those who are new student and preparing for first time okay you can skip industrial part okay you can skip also engineering mathematics material science also you can skip no problem in that okay but other subject in the provided sequence you need to do it is expected to complete that okay because it is important and other than your phase 1 subject in phase 2 this yellow block or line is compulsory okay i hope you get all the things and those who are repeaters those who already prepared this subject for other exams like gate and miss continuously preparing so you can do all the things no problem in that okay engineering mathematics also all chapters you can do linear algebra etc weightage is less but still you can do there is no problem in that okay so for mechanical you need to follow this and non technical part side by side you will do okay already now you have 30 to 45 days in your hand so properly make use of this and try to complete the syllabus and do continuous revision of that right if you have any other thing then you can comment down below all the best okay next for civil branch so what your guidelines about references and practice material i have given in phase 1 that will remain same correct now along with phase 1 which subject you need to cover that i will discuss so see here you can see the sequence which is most important so just work as per sequence only okay whatever the sequence i have given you just work for, uh, as per that so uh, now you will start with environmental engineering then structural analysis okay design of steel structure then rcc then construction material management hydrology irrigation engineering estimation cost and valuation and engineering mathematics now right? now those who are new student basically those who are preparing for first time so which subject you can skip okay so you can skip your uh, irrigation part okay irrigation engineering you can skip then you can skip estimation costing and valuation and also you can skip engineering mathematics but other subject other this uh, 1 2 3 4 5 6 subject you need to cover okay by default you need to cover that is most important because lots of weightage you can expect from us okay here you may get two to three question but that's fine because obviously in this less time you can't complete all the civil engineering subject because civil engineering syllabus is also vast right i hope you are getting so that is the only best thing you can do now okay and for repeaters no problem you can go for everything because already you covered the things okay just revise practice that's it the material will remain same i hope you got the idea about phase 2 and uh, non technical and right? technical part of your branch if you have any query any doubt definitely you can comment down below all the best